We live drums. Hi, Gary France here. Welcome to the Vibraphone, part of our continuing series on the percussion family. The Vibraphone's bars are made out of aluminum or aluminum. They're in much the same construction and size as bars on the marimba, but the actual material that's itself, the uh, aluminum, really creates a different sound. No longer a uh, a xylophone, meaning wood, this is a metallophone in Kurt Sox's definitions of instruments, a metallophone. And we have a great history of metallophones in our instruments of the Javanese gamelan, gongs, and, and etc. The vibraphone was made popular mostly as a novelty instrument. It was called the steamship table due to the shape of the resonators in the front, made people think it sounded like a calliope around the turn of last century. That would be the turn of the 1800 to 19, 1900s. I realize we're in 2011. Mostly played with two mallets, Right? Um, made popular by Red Norvo, Lionel Hampton, used in swing music, really a terrific instrument. The, the four mallet playing that we've come to know and love, really made popular by Gary Burton, uh, one of our wonderful exponents of the vibraphone and a mentor to us all. Right? So here on vibraphone, we can break down our uh, technique into three areas. First, we play, the playing position is pretty much the same as, a, uh, as any other marimba, although we do play on the ends of the bars. You'll note that the bars are now even with each other. The accidentals are on the same plane as the um, xylophone. And this is because to play a chord like a B major chord, to B flat, you can see that I'm able to play on the ends of the bars, right? I'm able to play on the ends of the bars and make use of that timbre. Right? So that having the ends of the bars makes a big difference. Part two of our technique. We have to dampen, and we have a dampening pedal. You can see that as I press my pedal, if I leave my pedal up, we get a dead sound. Or a dampened sound. With the pedal down, everything rings. It's all ringing. So we have to develop the ability to dampen and pedal. I'll grab a little bit harder mallets now so you can hear a difference with some harder mallets. And here on the vibraphone, if I play a chord, let's say I'm going to play an F suspension chord like that, I can by using mallet dampening. Again. We're able to have tension notes and actually dampen our way and create a much more legato line. So the vibraphone, the reason it has the vibe in the vibra vib vibraphone name is because we have a vibrato on it. When we looked at our resonators before, 
we, uh, we had a look, and I'll just show it to you quickly right here. Our resonators come off, and you'll note that on the back of the resonator, I have little flappers here. These flappers open and close our resonating chamber, creating a natural vibrato. I'll just slide it back in here into this instrument, bring it back up. Here we go. And if I play, I'll do some, some hand vibrato for you. We can hear that. We can also dampen above the note. We can change the acoustics even with our mouth. Getting some interesting effects. We have a, a series of belts, uh, rubber belts that we can connect to the vibraphone and run by a motor and it can have a continuous vibrato that we can have at different speeds. Okay, so this is pretty much it for the vibraphone. There are some extended techniques. <clears throat> we can play a vibraphone in contemporary music using a bow. And I thought I would show you that technique. This is, this is uh, very popular in, in uh, contemporary music. Just a traditional bass bow. You put a little bit of rosin on it. I've got some Pops rosin right here. I'm gonna put some on little bit of rosin like this, and we can actually bow notes on the vibraphone. A very beautiful sound used by Steve Reich and many, many great composers. We can also bend pitches on the vibraphone. And this is where we're actually adding a little bit to the mass of the bar. Let's listen to this. I put, I put a mallet on the bar. And you can hear me bending it. few of the extended techniques for the vibraphone. Vibraphone, popular in, in jazz, uh, classical contemporary music, an instrument of uh, infinite lyrical and uh, musical ability, and uh, really one of my favorites in the keyboard percussion area. So I hope you, uh, you enjoyed this video. If you have questions, feel free to email me at garyfrance.com and uh, really enjoy the vibraphone. I do. Thank you. We live drums.